Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. So today's video I decided first to test out the little combination that I wanted to use on a pop stick and I'm going to be using Get Paid, Whirl and also Elegance. They just look super super cute together. I'm always doing the most, finish my cup and reload. Let it swing right back. Let it swing right back. Back, back. So as you can see, I have already applied the clear easy tips to my practice hand and now I'm coming in with elegance which is the metallic like rose gold coppery acrylic colour which is available on my website and as always I will link the products down below so if you're interested in anything I'll have it linked and you guys can check them out if you want to. Moving on to the next nail, I'm going to be using Get Paid towards the cuticle area and blending it down the nail and then I'll be using Whirl which is a pre-mixed glitter infused acrylic powder and I'm using that on the free edge and feathering it up into the Get Paid khaki green colour which I've already applied. If you haven't already I would love if you could go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below on what colour your nails are right now as you are watching this video even if they are plain let me know in the comments and I will be replying to you guys of course as always and if you haven't subscribed definitely do that as well and turn on the notification bell because sometimes YouTube goes a little bit crazy and doesn't notify anybody that I've uploaded which is really annoying, especially when I put so much effort into trying to, you know, upload and make fabulous videos. But yeah, if you put on the notification bell, then you definitely should receive a notification as soon as I upload. Moving on to the next nail, this is going to be a marble nail and I'm going to be using Get Paid and Elegance. This combination is like so underrated, like a khaki green with the deep rose gold tones. It just looks super, super gorgeous. So I literally just chose those colours and I was like, I'm going to do it. Like it can be simple, that's fine. Like you could totally go over the top with this set and add crystals and the 3D work or hand painted art. But I just wanted to keep it quite simple and just really showcase the colors and they turned out super, super pretty. So yeah, I'm just going ahead and applying the marble. I'm just doing it in stages because the nails are so long, you would struggle to try and do the whole nail in one go. So definitely when doing marble, work in those stages and if you feel more comfortable doing it like that. Of course, if you want to do a full nail and you're only doing a short one, then do it in a couple of different beads, you know, you don't have to do it in stages. So this nail is the same as the other one that I've just done before the marble nail. So I'm coming in with get paid at the cuticle area and feathering that down the nail and then we are going in with whirl at the free edge and blending that back up the nail, layering it over the top of the khaki green colour and like doing a glitter ombre fade which I just absolutely love. They're super simple to do but they are so effective and you could do a full set of that and it would look bomb.
for the thumbnail I am going to be coming in and doing a full nail of Elegance which is the shimmery rose gold metallic colour. I did that on the pinky finger as well so I wanted to tie the whole look together. I also wanted to let you know that the practice hand that I'm using is the flat right practice hand which is available on my website and again I will list it down below with the products and the link as well. Once I've applied my acrylic I'm just going to allow that to set and I can move to the pinky finger again. So this is how the nails look just before I encapsulate them, super sparkly, super pretty and just really cute, like this set was cute. Yeah. So next I'm coming in with Nail Make Crystal Clear Acrylic and I'm just going to go ahead and encapsulate all the nails, make sure that at this point we are adding our apex, our structure and getting everything correct and tip top ready to hand file. So after I've encapsulated and everything's set and I've gone ahead and filed, I am going to come in with Nailmate Super Gloss No Wipe Top Coat and I'm going to apply this to all of the nails and then cure in the lamp for a full 60 second cure and this is my favourite bit, revealing the shine and the final look. So guys, this is the final result once I've cured in the lamp and I'll share with you oof, how beautiful it looks. I absolutely love how it turned out. If you love it, please give it a thumbs up if you didn't already. And as always, remember that you are bomb.com lit as fuck. And don't ever let anybody tell you any different because you've got this. Mwah. Bye.